Montana. Big sky country. The treasure state. People got a lot of names for it. I just call it home. Lived here my whole life. Still amazed at how beautiful it is. Maybe that's what blinded us to how ugly the people were getting. And everything became perfect. Good day to you, brother. You don't understand. No one took these groups seriously. They were different. Religious. Militant. I mean, it was a goddamn cult. The collapse is upon us, my children. They started buying up every farm for miles. Then the radio station. Not long after that, they even had the fucking cops. Their own sovereign religious state. Built right here. Under our noses. Ain't no one coming to help us. The government can't do shit. We're on our own. Fans, we save those lost souls, whether they want to be saved or not. People don't want to believe groups like this exist. People are scared, man. Some will wish to harm us. Some will wish to destroy all that we have built here together. Some will betray us. We don't know what he's capable of. Who? Their leader. Joseph Seed. They call him the father. And those in the outside world are blind. They do not believe. They have no faith. But I will make them see. Hey, Rookie. Rookie. You're wasting your time. There's no signal out here. Crossing over the handbane now. Motherfucker. Jesus. We're officially in Peggy country. How much longer? And just long enough for you to change your mind. So we can turn this bird around. You want me to ignore a federal warrant, Sheriff? No, sir. I want you to understand the reality of this situation. Joseph Seed, he's not a man to be fucked with. We've had run-ins with him before. They haven't always gone our way. Just sometimes. Sometimes it's best to leave well enough alone. Yeah, well, we have laws for a reason, Sheriff. And Joseph Seed's gonna learn that. Pratt, open a call with dispatch and for White Horse to dispatch, over. Right, Earl. We're approaching the compound, Nancy. Over. Roger, Sheriff. You still planning to go through with this? Over. We are. Unfortunately, still trying to talk some sense in our friend, the Marshal. Over. All right. It's lucky I'm not there. If you get into any trouble, you just let me know. Over. 10-4, over or not. Maybe we should have brought Nancy along with us instead of the probie. These Peggy's wouldn't fuck with her. Pratt. Why do you keep calling them Peggy's? Project at Eden's Gate. P.E.G. Peggy's is what the locals call them. You know, they started off harmless enough a few years back, but now they are armed to the teeth. You know, they're looking for a fight. Are you scared, Sheriff? We're here. Compound's just below. <sighs> oh, my Jesus. This is a bad idea. Last chance, Marshal. <sighs> We're going in. Roger that. Dispatch, you still there? Yes, go ahead, Sheriff. You don't hear from us for 15 minutes. Send in everyone. Call the goddamn National Guard if you have to. Over. Yes, sir, Sheriff. I'll be praying for you. Now listen up. Three rules. Stick close. Keep your guns in your holsters. And let me do the talking. Got it? Got it. Rookie! All right, everyone. Stay sharp. Let's go! Come 
They'll be in the church. Stick close. Eyes open. These folks can spook easily. Rook, on me. Stay loose, huh? What are they doing here? Be calm. Stay calm, everyone. Just go about your business. This doesn't concern you. Sheriff, I don't like this. Everything's fine, Hudson. Everything's just fine. Jesus Christ, you're wearing badges, aren't you? Yeah, but they don't respect badges much out here. They respect a 9mm. Not every problem can be solved with a bullet marshal. to do anything stupid. Relax, Sheriff. You're about to get your name in the paper. You'll be fine. Something is coming. You can feel it, can you? We are creeping toward the edge. And there will be a reckoning. That is why we started the project. Because we know what happens next. They will come. They will try to take from us, take our guns, take our freedom, take our faith. We will not let them. Sheriff, Just come on. Hold on Marshall. We will not let their greed, or their immorality, or their depravity hurt us anymore. Sheriff, you're not there will be no more thing. suffering. Oh, fuck. Joseph C. I have a warrant issued for your arrest on the suspicion of kidnapping with the intent to harm. Now, I want you to step forward and keep your hands where I can see them. There they are, the locusts in our garden. See, they've come for me. They've come to take me away from you. They've come to destroy all that we've built. Hold on, do not touch that service weapon! Hold on and don't stand down! Stand down! Put your guns down! Everyone calm down! We knew this moment would come. And we've prepared for it. Go. Go. God will not let them take me. and I heard, as it were, the noise of thunder, one of the four beasts say, Come and see! Step forward. And I saw. And behold, it was a white horse. And hell followed with him. Rookie, cuff this son of a bitch. God will not let you take me. Rook, put the cuffs on him. Sometimes the best thing to do is to walk away. Let's go. Take point, it's going right. On it. Stay on the path, rookie. Back up, back up. What are you doing? Everyone, keep back. Rookie, keep up. I am a federal marshal. 
Marshal, I'm ordering you to stand back. Just fine here. No need to call anyone. Yes, Father. Praise be to you. No one is coming to save you. Father! Hurry up. God has kept you under the shadow of his wings. Everything is unfolding according to God's plan. I am still here with you. The first seal has been broken. The collapse has begun. And we will take what we need. And we will preserve what we have. And we will kill all those who stand in our way. And these, the harbingers of you will see the truth. We gotta get out of here. Begin the revive! We gotta get out of here. <laughs>
going to try and get inside. If anyone's still out there, listen. If anyone's still alive. Jesus Christ. Rook, I'm sorry. I thought they got you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Check the room, Rook. Oh, Jesus. I had no idea. Fuck. We're putting this whole family away. All of them. Fucking lunatics. We're gonna get out of this, rookie. First things first, gotta arm ourselves. Here. All right, here's what we're gonna do. There's a road out there. We're gonna take it, we're gonna head northeast. It's probably only a few hours back to Missoula, and then, we're gonna come back here with a goddamn National Guard and we're gonna take out the rest of these... Okay, shh.
You know what that shit means? It means the roads have all been closed. It means the phone lines have been cut. It means there's no signals getting in and out of this valley. But mostly it means we're all fucked. Goddamn collapse. They all think the world's coming to an end now. They've been waiting for it, for years. Waiting for somebody to, to come along and fulfill their prophecy and kick off their goddamn holy war. Well, you sure as shit kicked. <sighs> Smartest thing for me to do would just be to hand you over. Get out of that uniform. We need to burn it. There's some fresh clothes there. When you get changed, you come and see me. We'll see if we can unfuck this situation.
anyone there. Come here, deputy. We need to talk. I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Most folks call me Dutch. I've been trying to piece together what's happening up top. It ain't good. Little I can gather is that your partners are alive for now. Seems they've been split up, each one handed off to a different member of Joseph's family. You want them back, I get it, I get it. I got friends that've been taken too. Problem is, there ain't no help coming. Nobody knows what's going on here, and they won't know until it's too late. There's got to be people out there willing to fight back against this cult. We just, we need to show them how. We need to build us a resistance. So the first thing we're going to do is get control of this island. Once we got some breathing room, we can figure out what's coming next. There's a gun and a map in the safe over there. Take them. I'll give you a call on your radio once you get your bearings. fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away. That was too close. Thanks. down by the docks. You help him out, and maybe he'd be willing to pick up a gun and return the favor. That can't be good. Who's shooting? 
See a way out of that one. Thank God you came along. I've got a bone to pick with that cult. Hey, deputy. Now that you're partnered up, the two of you should head to the forest research station. Cult's been crawling all over that place, using it as a depot for their goddamn bliss. Clear them all out. Send a message. We're not fucking around anymore. The cult's been creeping around the island for weeks. Looks like they're trying to set up a base of operations at the old ranger station.
sinking, and no. I ain't gonna have you climbing towers all over the county for me, so don't worry. Also, try not to fall from up there. centers. Every one of us. You, me. <laughs> Even the father knows deeply of sin. It's a poison that clouds our minds. What if I told you you could be free from sin? What if I told you that everything you ever dreamed could come true? What if I told you that everything could be overcome if you embraced an idea? Freedom from sin can come from the power of just one word. Watching this, know that you have been selected. You will be cleansed, you will confess your sins, and you will be offered atonement. Don't worry. You don't have to do anything. We'll come for you. Welcome to Eden's Gate. Falls End. 